Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Top 5 Best 4K Camcorders. Namibur 5. JVC JIHM 250U initially released in the fall of 2018, JVM's JIHM 250U updates the HM180 with built-in streaming and lower thirds graphics. It features a half 3 inch CMOS sensor, a 29 to 355 mm lens, a 3.5 inch articulating screen, a tilting viewfinder, optical stabilization, a DC input, dual card slots, North Dakota filters, and a microphone and headphone port. For video, it shoots 4K up to 30 FPS at 150 megabits per second and 1080p FHD up to 120 FPS at 50 megabits per second. And it uses the MPEG-4 codec, which supplies footage to the MAV and AVC HD formats. While, for ST. Namibur 4. Sony PXWZ90 V4 K HD. Initially released in the fall of 2017, Sony's Z90V brings professional features to its sibling, the AX700. It features a 1-inch CMOS sensor, a 29-348mm lens, a 3.5-inch articulating screen, a tilting viewfinder, optical stabilization, a DC input, dual card slots, North Dakota filters, and a microphone and headphone port. For video, it shoots 4K UHD up to 30 FPS at 100 megabits per second and 1080p FHD up to 60 FPS at 50 megabits per second. And it uses the MPEG-4 codec, which supplies footage to the XAVCS and AVCHD formats. While, for stills, it provides 14.2 MP photos in the 16:9 ratio dot like the AX700, Sony's also equipped this camera with the slow and quick mode, capturing super slow motion videos in HD, up to 960 FPS. And it also obtains its outstanding 273-point phase detection AF system, for confident focusing and HDR capabilities using HLG. But, unlike that model, the Z90V features a top handle with dual 3-pin XLR inputs with phantom power. It also has a 3G SDI output to connect a monitor. Additionally, this model even supports both the 2.4 and 5.8 GHz Wi-Fi bands. And you can live stream to the RTMP-RTMPS protocols to supported streaming platforms. Namibur 3. Panasonic HCX2000. Initially released in the spring of 2020, Panasonic's HCX2000 finally updates the wildly popular HCX1000, released six years prior. And it's their next-generation ultra-compact broadcast-ready entry into the HC lineup. It features a half 5 inch Mohs sensor, a 25-600mm lens, a 3.5-inch articulating screen, a tilting viewfinder, optical stabilization, a DC input, dual card slots, North Dakota filters, and a microphone and headphone port dot with this new update, Panasonic opted for several key refinements over the original model, despite its slightly smaller sensor. Namely, they've improved the optical zoom range, now boasting a 24x zoom rather than 20x. And they've also gone ahead and improved the codex, now bringing 10-bit 422 internal recording and the high-efficiency HEVC option. Additionally, they've opted for an ultra-compact Handycam-inspired design. Namibur 2.Canon HFG60. Canon's HFG60 marks the latest entry in the Vixia compact consumer lineup and Canon's next generation of budget-friendly 4K-equipped camcorders. Initially released in the spring of 2019 alongside the lower-end HFG50, it replaces the older HFG40 model, released in 2016. It features a 13 CMOS sensor, a 25.5 to 382.5 mm lens, a 33 articulating touchscreen, a tilting viewfinder, optical stabilization, DC in, dual card slots, North Dakota filters, time lapse, microphone, and headphone inputs. For video, it shoots 4K UHD up to 30 FPS at 150 megabits per second and 1080p FHD up to 60 FPS at 35 megabits per second. And it uses the MPEG-4 codec, which supplies footage in the highly compatible MP4 format. 
While, for stills, it provides 8.29 MP photos. Canon's camcorders are known for delivering excellent image quality and lenses. But, Canon's also known for its outstanding phase detection AF system. Namibur 1. Sony's AX700, initially released in the fall of 2017, replaces the outgoing AX100 flagship. And it now takes the helm as Sony's newest high-performing Handycam model, aimed at the prosumer market.it, features 13 stacked Exmor RSCMOS sensor, 29.0 to 348.0 mm Zeiss lens, 3.53 articulating touchscreen, tilting viewfinder, optical stabilization, HDR, DC in, dual card slots, North Dakota filters, time lapse, wireless connectivity, headphone and microphone inputs. And video capabilities, this camera supplies 4K UHD video up to 30 FPS at 100 megabits per second in the MPEG-4 codec, to the XAVCS and AVCHD formats. And it shoots 1080p FHD video up to 120 FPS at 100 Mbps. For stills, it provides 12 MP images in the 3 2 ratio. Sony's equipped the camera with the slow and quick mode, which provides super slow motion HD videos up to a whopping 960 FPS. This creates videos that are 32x slower than real time, and it's a rare feature in this class. But, it's one that delivers an enormous amount of control for a consumer camera. Sony has also equipped the camera with S-Log, s gamut and H- Check up the video link description please. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and hit the like button.